Hey friends, it's Rosie and I am back finally. My husband, I, and my son, we bought a new house, y'all. I've been away for quite some time. I'll share why in a different video, but for now, I want to share my new house. I do want to apologize in advance because this is not going to be as smooth as the other home tours that you will see on YouTube because I've never done anything other than, um, you know, recipe videos. So this is super new, okay? So I've already showed you the entrance to my home. Down the hallway, the first thing you're going to see is this closet. I'm going to use this for storage. And below um, in this closet is actually the crawl space underneath the carpet. But yeah, that's the entrance. I think they call it a foyer or foyer. I don't know. We're just going to call it the entrance, okay? So in here, this is the dining room slash living room. I love this home because it is so open. Originally, I did not want to open home. I wanted something really old-fashioned. But as soon as I walked into this home, we knew we had to have this house, okay? So that is our fireplace. Again, I wanted something old-fashioned. I wanted a wood-burning fireplace, but this is gas, and I actually love it. And I love the flooring. It is so pretty to me. I love the grays in it, the browns. Those are my colors. I love grays and browns, for those of you that don't know. So on Instagram, I've been sharing all the home models that I was looking at during this process. And the one I went with was this one, y'all. I loved this island. I love the fact that the range is in or on the island. Now, there were a lot of concerns. A lot of people didn't think it was going to be enough counter space for me. But you know what? This is perfect. Because I have the range there, once again, I have space on each side of the range, and I can always use that bar uh, top as well, if needed. But you know what? I think I'm going, no, I know I'm going to be good because I was playing around in the model's uh, kitchen. But look at the range. I fell in love with it. And we have these beautiful granite countertops. I love the backsplash. Um, I have yet to seal the granite, but I'm going to do that in a couple of days. I haven't officially moved into the home yet but we do have the keys obviously but anyway this is beautiful as well is that called a yeah y'all know what it's called but I'm blinking I'm not gonna make a fool of myself by trying to guess the name but anyway here is the drawer or drawers and cabinets and I love the fact that everything is in one spot so when I am recording my videos I don't have to go across the kitchen to find something everything is right here and I love it. And I have all my plugins and everything in this kitchen. There are some USB plugins right there and, you know, regular outlets. I love it. I love everything about it. And it came with some new appliances. There's a brand new dishwasher. Um, I love this sink. It has the little um, sprayer thingy here. Y'all, I don't know the, like, terms for this stuff. I am so new at this, but yeah. But again, this is a brand new home. When we signed the papers, it was just like sticks. And it is so crazy just to watch people actually build a house from like the bottom up. We loved it. So this is our oven and the um, microwave. My refrigerator, I have to buy that myself, but it's not there yet. We actually just purchased it today and it won't be there for, uh, I think, the beginning of April. This is right across from the kitchen. This is the pantry. It is very small, but it's going to be very workable because I have a lot of space in this house. Uh, this house is a little over 3,000 square feet, and that is plenty of room for us. Now, originally, um, this room was going to be my office, but since we've, you know, got the keys and everything, I decided to change this to a guest room because this room is right across from the kitchen where they could just walk over there, get what they want. And it's also next to a bathroom and it's on the first floor. So I feel like, you know, it has everything that a guest needs right there. This closet is actually going to be uh, for all of my props though. Sorry guests, that's gonna be for my props. So yeah, we are right across from the kitchen. And right outside, like I told you, uh, right outside of the guest room that was going to be my office, there's a bathroom and it has like the shower. Not a tub, but this works fine. I doubt anybody really, you know, 
when you go to other people's house, I don't see a lot of people take baths, right? You usually take showers. So this shower is going to be great. And it looks very easy to clean. And the backsplash in here is the same as my kitchen. You'll find that throughout the whole home. Lots of space in there, guys. Or not really, but lots of drawers. That's what I meant to say. So let's go over here. This is right outside the bathroom that we just came out of. This is my garage. And this is actually the first time that I've had a garage. Isn't that funny? Or an attached garage that's like directly into the home. So this is a three-car garage, lots and lots of space. I'm going to try to talk my husband into keeping one of his trucks outside so I can build some shelves in here, and if needed, I can, you know, build a pantry in here as well. And, yeah, a lot of other switches and stuff like that that I'll probably never do. That's going to be my husband's thing. So now we can go on upstairs. So down here we have laminate. Upstairs is carpet. It gets really cold in Washington. So yeah, carpet is like, yeah, I love carpet. So up here, as soon as you get on top of the stairs, that's my son over there trying to hide. He didn't want to be on camera right now. But anyway, this is the master room. Nice, spacious. I love everything about this room. I'll probably be blogging in here a lot. And over here is my husband's closet and I totally tricked him into taking this closet I told him hey there's lots of natural light it's right there you know you have a, a window and he fell for it so he took this room and I'll show you my closet in a second but yeah he he doesn't mind he was gonna give me the other one anyway I'm pretty sure of it and yeah our room has double doors and again please bear with me this is like totally new this is a new type of video for me to do. I promise I'll get better once we, you know, start doing more of these. Now, this is our master bathroom. We have the tub and the shower, his and her sink. I love the colors, still, you know, tan brownish colors. And over here, I'm slowly going. I don't know why I did it so slow. I was trying to be dramatic and do it like everyone else's. Um, House tours that are all super perfect, but yeah, I'm totally not there yet. <laughs> anyway, the toilet is in there, and over here is my closet. And I actually feel a little bad for tricking my husband into taking the other closet, but again, he doesn't mind. And if he ever needs more space, he can come in here and use a little space. <laughs> okay, so let's head on out of here. And I'm not sure if I'm actually going to use all this space anyway. I don't think I need it. So once we leave here, we're going to go to the hallway. Now, on the left is our laundry room. It is small, but there is plenty of room for me to do laundry. Because in our apartments that we've had, we never had a laundry room. They were always like in the hallway or, you know, close to the kitchen, but it's never been an actual laundry room. So this is so cool to me. And that's the attic upstairs and the little itty bitty folding table. I don't know how I can fold on that. I'll probably be folding like on top of the washer and dryer, but yeah, I'll probably just place a detergent right there. So we're going to go down the hallway some more and on the right will be a smaller room. And this is just a regular room. It's a nice size. I might turn this into an office. I don't know yet. I really don't know yet. And yeah, nice size little closet. I don't know what I'm going to do with this room yet. We have uh, five rooms, including the room downstairs. And we also um, have a bonus room. And I'll show you the bonus room in a second. But this is the main bathroom on the second floor. And this is the bonus room. So the bonus room is where we'll be most of the time. This is where we'll be watching our movies and I'll be beating everybody in Uno and Monopoly. That's a total lie because I'm always the one that loses. But yeah, I'll still have fun in here. And outside the window, we have a view of the golf course. Now my garden is non-existent right now, my yard, because I still don't know what I want. Well, I know, I have some ideas, but I'm unsure what we want or what I want. My husband's letting me 
the side actually. So uh, yeah, we're going to go back out in the hallway. We're going to leave this bonus room and we're going to go to the right. Now first that is, I don't know why I'm showing you that over there. Okay, so first that is the linen closet and up there, I'm not sure why I'm showing you that, but we'll just go into this room and my son totally claimed this room. Like as soon as we seen the model, he knew that he wanted the room next to the bonus room. And he chose the perfect room because he has such the view. Like he has a view of a golf course and the non-existent yard right now. <laughs> and if you guys have any ideas like for landscaping or, you know, home decor, let me know down below in the description box. I am open for ideas. And this is his closet. It is a walk in closet and that's plenty of space for him he loves it and I'll let him pick like the theme and all that stuff for his room and across from his room on the other side of that linen closet in the hallway here is another room and this room gets a lot of natural light so I'm actually thinking that maybe this room should be my office I don't know but this room is nice size as well I think my son's room and this room is bigger than uh, the room across the hall that I showed you all a couple of minutes ago. But yeah, this room gets a lot of natural light. But don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I'm going to move into this house ASAP, or should I say get settled into the house because we're already kind of moved in. And then we'll start getting back to the recipes. If you have any recipe requests, hit me up on Instagram as well. Later, guys and girls.